Hey everyone, and welcome back to my next video. Today we're gonna to be doing something a little bit different. We're actually gonna be playing a game called Lake that just dropped about a month ago. I think they had a beta about a year ago, but it's fully released now on Steam. And the developers of Whitehorn Games have been nice enough to give me this game for free. So I've linked it in the description if you wanna go ahead and check it out. But I do wanna state there is no like affiliate link. They haven't sponsored me like monetarily for this game. So uh, it's just linked down there if you wanna check it out. But uh, without holding back any further, let's jump into the video. I'm so excited right now. I, I literally can't wait to get into this game. Uh, I guess we're at a computer. Then add it. Oh, we're in an apartment. Uh, it's funny how a program designed to help organize your life. Waiting for the next message. Is the reason why I can't be at this Labor Day party. I guess she's typing this. But I'm glad we made the deadline. Guess so. Typing an email, I guess. Oh, yeah. And I'm glad I can now spend two stress-free weeks in good old Providence Oaks. Answer it. Answer it. Hello? There it is, Steve. Uh, hope I didn't wake you up. I just came home and was wondering if everything worked out all right. Good guy, Steve. Oh, Steve. Yes, we made the deadline. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Uh, I feel so bad you couldn't make it. Hope you guys had a nice Labor Day party. Oh, yes. I mean, the band was great. Look at that computer. The pool. <laughs> oh, and then Roy got really sick. No, wait. Brian. And then he fell in the pool, too. And... No, Roy. Uh, wait. <laughs> I'll tell you all about it. What? <laughs> <laughs> Afternoon. I, I won't be there for two weeks, remember? Gotta love when jobs do that. Yeah, but, uh... Oh, my God. The... Do you really have to? Do you really have to? That's happened to me. Yeah. But I will continue testing for at it. Oh, okay. Right. Awesome. Um Don't do it. I better get some sleep now. My plane leaves early in the morning. Okay, Meredith. Have a wonderful flight. I, I'll talk to you soon. Sounds good, Steve. He's just trying to go on vacation. That's all, Steve. Man. Providence Oaks. Oregon. So September first. Mr. Coleman. Nineteen eighty six. <laughs> okay, Frank. Thanks so much for making time for me on Labor Day. Thanks, Frank. No problem, Meredith. Postal workers always have each other's back. Your dad helped me dozens of times whenever I was in a bit of a pickle. Well, I hope I can fill his shoes. He hardly ever missed a day. I'm sure you'll do great. You know what? While we're on route, why don't we deliver some mail in our beautiful little lake town? And show me the ropes? Sure. All right, then. Getting ready <laughs> to roll. This game already looks beautiful. Oh, and the music, too. So happy. Lake. I love it. It reminds me of, uh, there's a Netflix show called Silvertooth. They're just gonna have a really similar, like, logo pop-up. Man. This is, I already know I'm gonna love this game. It's just so beautiful. It's always more beautiful than I remember it. Exactly. I don't think I'll ever get tired of driving around it. And there's our first stop. Okay, sir, what's the plan? Delivering mail is like a walk in the park with mailboxes. <laughs> Take this bag, walk to the mailbox, and insert the mail. Oh, <laughs> actually playing now. Ooh. All right, WASD to walk around. Makes sense, makes sense. Walk to the mailbox. I almost walked to the gas tank. Do, do, do. Press E to deliver mail. That's cool. I can look around. Walk back to the mail truck. There we go. End of the video. That, that's all it is. That, <laughs> that's the game. The whole game is right there. I'm just messing. There you go. Nothing too difficult, right? Oh. I think I should be able to face the challenge. <laughs> I bet. Didn't you go to MIT? MIT, man. I left here from Massachusetts 22 years ago. Shouldn't you get a job in computers then? That's really booming right now. <laughs> well. Actually, um, uh... Hold that thought. We just arrived at our next address. It's a package this time, so you'll have to get it out of the back. Hmm. Switching it up, switching it up. E to exit the mail truck. I could do that. Up to the back of the mail truck. Looks like we're delivering in a residential area now. E to open the hatch. Select the parcel. 103 High Street. 
uh, and pick up. Walk to the front of the door. I wonder if there'll be like bigger packages, uh, like huge packages that you need to like, I don't know, work with someone else to deliver. I don't, I have no idea. Uh, okay. Press E to ring doorbell. Hello? Anyone home? Nope. No answer. All right. All right. On to the next button. I think it said I can hold, hold shift to walk faster. Yeah, there is a difference. Okay. It's not like I'm like full blown sprinting and <laughs> look a little out of place. You're getting the hang of it. So, where were we? Computers. Should I buy one? Yes, always yes. Uh, well, it depends on what you want to use it for. Bookkeeping. I always make a mess of my tax returns. What is it? TurboTax.com? Sure, there are programs for Go that, for it. But you'll still have to put in some work yourself. I was afraid you were going <laughs> to say that. I'll bug you about it another time. Our next address Sounds good, is Frank. Right around the corner. Good guy, Frank. <laughs> Can I swing on the tire swing? There's no place like home. Sure isn't. Can't wait to get home either. The Mets are playing the Giants. Oh no. Before I get out, what time do I start tomorrow? 7 a.m. sharp. Just check in at the post office. Okay, Frank. See you tomorrow. The Mets are playing the Giants. Anyways, we'll check in at the post office. <laughs> Walk to the front door of the house. So this is me, I guess. Do I have a dog? Do I have a dog? Wait. Sorry, we're taking a detour. Blinky? Or no, Binky. Binky? I see there's like an eye, but I think it's a dog bone that they've draw or drawn. All right, let's actually, let's actually enter the house. Focus, Peter, focus. Press E to enter your parents' house, it said. I guess we're living with our parents for a moment. The wise residence Monday afternoon. Hi, Meredith. I just hey, wanted to let you know that dad and I landed safely. It's a Florida weather. Oh, she's in Florida. Would be. I'll call again soon. <laughs> oh, one more thing. The freezer stuffed with food and there's blueberry pie in the fridge. Ooh, blueberry pie. Wish it was pumpkin pie, but I'll accept. I'll accept. Meredith, it's Steve. I didn't get the chance to say it earlier, but thanks so much for being a trooper. <laughs> I know you had other plans for Labor Day weekend, but nailing the deadline for Ad at 87 could very well be the most important milestone in our company's history. Enjoy your well-deserved time off. Don't get too used to it. Oh my god. Or am I? I don't like Steve. I'll talk to you later. Can I like press F to quit job or something? <laughs> I'll just deliver mail the rest of my life. Tuesday, September 2nd, morning. Good morning, Meredith. Ready for your first day? Of course. Oh, good morning, Frank. Ready to rock. Or yawns, I guess. Good morning. I'm going to, you know what? I'm ready to rock. Let's do it. Good morning, Frank. Ready to rock. It's a great day to be on the road. I already filled up the mailbag in the truck, so you're good to go. Oh, thanks, Frank. I to tell you, there's a map in the cabin in case you get lost. I'm going to need that. Lost? Me? Uh, no. Thanks. I'll probably need that. <laughs> bon voyage. Thank you, Frank. Oh, I think the, the biggest struggle of mine is going to be remembering everyone's names. I also don't know how open world this is. If it's open world, I can see there's like people walking around and stuff, but I'm, I won't test that just yet. We can enter our mail truck, though, and we'll see on how good of a driver Rocket is. Press M to open and close the map. Oh, uh, you can place waypoints. You can hide the delivery list, and show it, and you can zoom in. Cool. Um, it looks like we have three different letters and we have four different parcels, uh, and I guess we can kind of just pick the way we want to go, right? Oh, X is to place waypoint. I thought it was left click. I wish it was left click, but that's okay, because we can just do something like this. All right, we're off. Oh my God, this thing's got some speed. Hopefully, yeah, this is America. I was just going to say, I was like, do I actually have to drive on the, the right side of the road? Does this stop here? I see the little like square in the ground, but um, it looks like our package is actually delivered on the side. Oh God, rocket, don't crash. Don't crash. Little horrible stop like this, completely illegal. And let's deliver this package. So uh, we're on Main Street. So I think if we do this, right? We just have to select it. Oh my God, it's a teddy bear. So cute. Uh, okay, 207 Main Street. Pick this guy up. And uh, if you can see in the bottom, so if you see in that direction, the way that I'm pointing, this is weird because everything's mirrored. 
uh, you'll see Main Street. That's how I knew a street was on. So uh, just in case you guys don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, and you can see on our mini map, it says that we need a package delivered here to the general store. We... We something. What does that say? Something baseball cards? Oh, we trade baseball cards. Hello. Look at that. Apple 16 cents? Great price. Oh, wait, isn't it like 1986? That would probably make sense. Talk to the general store clerk. Can I help you? Hello. Here's today's mail. Mm, new in town. Your face looks familiar. I could tell her smoking well, indoors too. Up here and then left for college 22 years ago. Man. 22 years ago, back when they called me Nancy Sinatra instead of Nancy Reagan. <laughs> so now you're back, huh? I know what it's like. Actually, this is only temporary, or you do. We don't want this to be temporary. I don't want to go back to that job. It's best not to feel bad about it. Only a few people ever really make it. <laughs> Okay, hey, Nancy. It's been raining a lot lately. We're gonna start driving in a thunderstorm. Look at this food. Can I? I don't know if they're gonna yell at me. We got big big dings. We got pops pop song. I think that's how it is. Uh, it looks like we have needs, which kind of look like nerds. It's all just like knockoff food. I love it. Coming soon, photography mini lab photos de developed in just one day. And that is, uh, you could, it's dating this a little bit. <laughs> Still cool, though. I like the little ding as we walk through, uh, through the buildings. All right. On to our next package, which is just down the road. Um, I don't think this is like, I don't know, like Need for Speed or GTA where, like, I can actually get pulled over. We'll see if I crash into something later on because I'm not the greatest driver if I actually, uh, will get, like, pulled over. Uh, we'll just pull right into this person's driveway. Okay. Letter. It looks like this is still on Main Street. Will it tell me if I go on my map? 103 Main Street. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. So this is for packages in the back. We have to go to the side, right? Right? Or is it... Oh, wait, no. It's on our back. Duh. And then we have to deliver this. Oh, right into this. I'm stupid. Deliver mail. I remember this is the old Sugarman place, but the envelope says McGill. Must have moved away. I mean, it has been 22 years, though. That's probably why. I wonder if I can... Maybe not, but I wonder if you can deliver mail out your window, if they're letters. That'd be kind of neat. Uh, let's just illegally back into the street like this. Good, this is a small town, and I'm not going to be killed. Uh, that just shows it's Main Street. Looks like we have the general store, the post office... Let's head out to the 500 Lake Road, way away to the left, just so we can get experience of this driving. I'm actually enjoying this. <laughs> and look at that view, guys. Just look at that. It's beautiful. All right, let's go left. I don't know if there's blinkers, so we're just going to drive fast and hope a cop doesn't see us. I also have no idea what speed we're going, so we're going to just keep driving and hoping for the best. Man, we're cruising. How do I hit the nitrous on this thing? <laughs> I wonder if there's like deer that might run out or something. Looks like there's a lot of like dirt roads and stuff. So I wonder if like deliveries start to go like off the road and things like that. This also reminds me of a game. It's called like Kona. I used to play it back in the day. It was pretty, pretty sweet. And there's Stan's Diner. Wait, it's called Moe's Diner now? Welcome to Moe's. All right, let's let's back it in. We gotta gotta have some kind of quality. All right, there we go. <clears throat> and we're at a uh, 500 Lake Road. Do do do. We'll pick this up. Let's go deliver this guy. Totally uh just looked at the sky to bring that down, but <laughs> here we are. Famous since 1954. So that would have been. When we were here when we were younger. So I wonder if it just got renamed. Like a new owner. I don't know. Meredith Wise? As I live and breathe. Come here, hon. Hon. Uh, now, let me look at you. My, oh my. A few lines here and there. And the occasional gray hair. 
But my gosh. How dare you? Right? <laughs> How do I insult her? That's what I want to say. <laughs> That's what I want to do. Well, hello to you too, Maureen. Oh, uh, well, Maureen, long time no see. We're going to do the first one. We're not being oh, nice. You too, Maureen. Man. Ow, don't Occasional like gray that. hair. It suits you. The gray hair. It makes a person more distinguished, is what I well, you're really distinguished. Now come here. Tell me everything. To the mirror. But Marine, I have to do work to do. I have work to do. Okay, one quick drink then. Do I you know what? Okay, we'll have one quick drink. Because I want to know why the diner's name has changed. Okay. One quick but I don't like her. I know you're busy, huh? Little bird told me all about your temporary mail job already. It's temporary. We mind if it goes full time. Quickly around here. So, coffee? Something stronger. <laughs> Espresso. Um, I will not take no for an answer. <laughs> it's like I'm 17 again, Maureen. Coffee sounds good, thanks. No, really, I'm good. Uh, coffee sounds good. Let's coffee do that. Good. I, I would give you more if you weren't rude to me. Right Two and coffees. One piece of blueberry pie, if I remember correctly. You had one. I prefer on pumpkin. Afternoon after school at one point. You know me too well, Maureen. Actually, I try to stay healthy these days. We're not going to say that. That's so oh, rude. You know me too well, Maureen. <laughs> Always have, always will. Ashley, one blueberry pie. Heck yeah. And Ashley, uh, could you keep an eye on the bar for me for a bit? I'm gonna take my break now. You're a real trooper. <laughs> Ashley? Oh, sweet Mary. What are you doing? Uh, Ashley? Everything okay, huh? Lord have, mercy. Lord have mercy is right. That didn't sound good. No offense, Maureen, but I'm going to back away slowly. <laughs> Maybe you should check that out. I'm going with the but I, back, I should back away slowly. Honestly, first the roof and now this. Ugh, that poor kid is like a What kid? Magnet. I'm sorry, Meredith. Looks like I've got my hands full for a bit. Next time, I want to hear everything. You hear? Uh, don't be a stranger now. Yes, ma'am. I won't be a stranger. <laughs> oh, Maureen. Oh. All right, we're going to... Oh, wait, I almost just randomly hopped in a car. This isn't GTA. I can't just steal vehicles. Man. All right, let's, uh, let's hop back in here. We're going to go to our next point. Oh, there's another vehicle. I haven't seen, like, other vehicles in the game. Hey there. Whoa. Hold up. We're illegally stopping. Look at this. It's so pretty. There's like trees growing in the river though. It's a little weird. And I know it's totally possible. It's a little weird. Alright, so we got a letter right here. Again, I wonder... Can I deliver it out the window? Maybe not. It'd be cool uh, if there was a button to press and it would put like your hazards on. Uh, just like a little bit more immersion. Be cool. Uh, let's deliver our mail here. 102 Lake Road. And uh, I've also found out there's apparently a radio that I could turn on in here that I didn't know about. Uh, if I press R, I guess not. It's not turning on. I wonder if I just like unlock it in the game. But I can press Q to beat my horn. <laughs> That's kind of cool. I wonder if that interacts with like other vehicles. Like I can beat my horn at them. Kind of tell them to get out. Oh, there's a bunch of cats here. <gasps> Look at them all. Wait, there's a bird. I can't look up, but there's a bird. <laughs> Alright, let's grab our package. Uh I'm guessing this is probably two hundred. Let's pull it let's pull it out. We'll grab the teddy bear. Well, hello there, big cuddly guy. I agree, big cuddly guy. Look at him. Let me just make sure. This is two hundred Lake Road. We guessed correctly. Look at these cute Oh my god, even the mailbox is a cat. Oh I love this. Look at them all. Look at them all. Hello. Oh my God. I'm in love. There's even one on the roof. <laughs> Get down from there. Oh my. All right. What weird cat woman lives here? Oh, that's Genevieve. <laughs> Genevieve. Hello there. What's your name then? Well, I'm not a mailman exactly. I'm Meredith Wise. I think it's Wise. 
I miss Jenkins, right? I'm Meredith, Meredith Wise. We're gonna go with that. Hi, Miss Jenkins, right? I'm Meredith. Meredith Weiss? Weiss, of Weiss. course. You're Emily's girl, aren't you? This is Meryl Weiss, Genevieve. She used to live in town <laughs> years and years ago. 22 years to be exact, but who's counting? <laughs> Her. It's Meredith. Wouldn't want the cat to get it wrong. Uh, let's let's go with this. I don't want to come off wrong. Years to be exact, but who's counting? <laughs> Has it been that long? That's almost oh, two Genevieves ago. Calm down, Genevieve. Just Genevieve B three. Remember me? Don't what the heck? Of course, you're the cat lady. No, we can't say that. How can I forget Miss Mildred Jenkins? I'm sorry, but I really don't. Uh, uh, I want to say the bottom one because I don't. Of course, I don't know who she is, but I don't want to be a jerk. We're gonna go. Of course, how can I forget? How can I forget Miss Mildred Jenkins and her cats. Of course, seems like they've multiplied. Yes, I do like cats. Is that such a crime? <laughs> So what if I have slightly more We did I didn't mean to too, like Jen uh, here and Thomas and Oliver. I didn't mean to be rude. Wait, did you have a package for me then? Yeah, I had a teddy bear. Hopefully this makes it better. Yes, ma'am, I think it's a toy bear. Yes, here you go. Let's not spoil it. Just yes, here you yes. go. Here you go. I feel like if I say bear, she's gonna get mad at me. Ah, thank you, dear. Looks like another gift from my son. Still doing everything to get into my good graces, except actually drop by. Uh-oh. Yeah, Teddy Bear is a poor substitute. I'm sure he means well. He's probably just busy. Well, anyway, he's got to run. I'm not going to say that. That's horrible. Uh, uh I don't want to agree. I'm trying to play. Uh, yeah. I'm sure he means well. He's probably just busy. <laughs> That's what he says. That's probably what you say to poor Emily, too. Anyway, I won't keep you any longer. I was trying to be nice. Give Emily my best. Goodbye, Miss Jenkins. Genevieve. <sighs> well, that backfired. I don't think Cat Lady's going to like me. But here we are. <laughs> We're back. <laughs> Man. Tough crowd. Tough crowd. This reminds me of... Uh, days, I won't even need that map. That is true. I'm kind of getting the hang of this. This reminds me of like the Telltale games. Like what is it, the Walking Dead games and stuff? Ooh, he's fixing a car. Let's uh let's pull in here. I don't know if we actually have to get gas or not. Oh, I think this is the place that we started at. Uh which we're at 300 Lake Road. Let's grab the package. And uh I wonder if I could just give it to the person instead of did these folks order? I don't know. Probably parts if I had to guess. I wonder if I could just give it to her. Hi there. I've got some mail for this address. You're not Frank. Nope. Luckily, I don't have I don't think a mustache would suit me. I'm Meredith Weiss. I'll be delivering your mail for a while. I'm gonna do the first one. Luckily, I don't think a mustache would suit me. Haha, ha, real funny. But that doesn't explain why Frank gave you the keys for the goose. The goose? The goose? Yes. Your white and wobbly van, duh. She has a Ghostbusters. I'm Lori. I'm Providence. Ghostbuster shirt. And I'm the one who keeps the goose running. <laughs> well, Thomas is my father. Does that count? Aren't you a little young to be a mechanic? No, don't say that. Are you kidding me? Well, Why would I say that? Does oh. that count? Thomas. Yes, that surely counts. There we go. My Street cred. Teaching me since the day I was born. There is no one better in PO than me. And I have to get back to work now. But I suppose you may drive the goose <laughs> on one condition. If there's ever anything wrong with it, you bring it back to me, yes? Yeah. When I accidentally drive it into the lake. All right, all right, I promise. Well, I don't have much of a choice, do I? <laughs> I'll say that I promise. All right, I promise. Good. Perfect. Uh, did Frank tell you about the radio? No. Oh, no. It currently only receives the local station. Plus, sometimes it cuts out altogether. Oh, fantastic. If that happens, just give it a big old bang on the dashboard and that should fix it right up. I'm working on it, I promise. Okay, thanks, Lori. Uh, er, thanks, I guess. <laughs> no, we'll be nice. Thanks, Lori. Thanks, Lori. I like Lori. No problem, Miss W. Miss W? Official. She's not, I guess she is young, but I was going to say she's not that much, uh, what is it? Not that much younger than us. Or I guess... 
we're probably actually like 30 late 30s I guess we are older we don't look that way in my opinion that's not me making fun of the game by the way that's just me saying I just don't think that she looks like she's like late 30s 40s but uh oh press R to toggle radio did I actually press it oh I don't actually press it I like it. Looks like we gotta go off road. Cool. Um, I think I'll leave the music on. I kind of vibe that. That looked like that was a hiking trail back there. Oh, covered bridges. The Bear Creek Bridge. Look at this. This is so cool. This is so cool. I love it. Oh, right. Bear Creek, near the old lumber yard. There we go. Man, look at this. It's a cabin right next to a big waterfall. Do you think that floods? I don't know. Let's uh, let's park right here. Hop on out, and we'll get them, get them their letters. Looks like they might be doing work on the roof, too. There's a new face. Uh, a rare sight for a secluded lumberjack. Yes, indeed. As of today, I'll be delivering the mail. Uh, well, yeah, we'll do the yes indeed. Yes indeed. As of today, I'll be delivering the mail. Great. I'm Robert. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Robert. I'm Meredith, and here's your mail. Thanks. I like the beard. Better open this right away. Why such a rush? Oh, what the? I'll leave it to you then. Have a nice day. That doesn't sound good. We'll say that doesn't sound good. Doesn't sound good. Crap. That's what it sounds like. Bull crap. <laughs> Freshly baked bull crap. Not good indeed. I'll be on my way. Bye. <laughs> that sound. The the sound can't be worse than the smell. Maybe That's a good response. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I have to take a better look at this. Have a nice day. Sounds good. Uh, return to the post office. That's good. I can do that. Let's hop on in. We'll head back to the post office. Looks like we have finished day one of uh, delivering some mail. This is close to where I had my first kiss. Say what? I was just driving in the woods? I don't know. Maybe that's from like the kind of city boy that I... In the woods? <laughs> Say what? Oh, I didn't hit the curb. I didn't hit the curb. Oh my god, I almost just killed a woman. I am... Uh, you didn't see that. You didn't see that. <laughs> I was so like zoned in, just kind of driving, vibing with the music, and I was just nailed someone right onto the right on the street. Um, yeah, needless to say, I'm gonna be losing my license soon. But um, you you didn't see that. You didn't see that. Didn't happen. It's just <laughs> hop out. <sighs> uh, the wise residence, Tuesday evening. Answer it. Hello. Hi, Meredith. It's Mom. Hey, Mom. How are you? How's the job? Pretty good. Hi, Mom. Doing great. Hi, Mom. I'm all right. Job is okay, I guess. No, I'm doing great. Hi, Mom. I'm doing great. It's so relaxing to be outside and drive around. It really is. That's great to hear. Dad says it's strange not having to drive the truck anymore. <laughs> I can imagine that. How is Dad? It must be strange for you as well. How are you doing? Um, Let's... Uh, do I want to ask how mom's doing or how's dad doing? Let's that's I can dad. Imagine that. How is dad? Can he handle <laughs> all this freedom? Ugh, don't get me started. He went on two fishing boat trips already. <laughs> I wonder if we could fish in this game. Probably not, but poker with his new buddies. Buddies. Oh, I'm almost out of coin. I'm calling from a bar and dad's ordering a margarita again. Oh no, dad. Talk soon. <laughs> Back in the day when there were pay phones. Uh, so I get to choose stay home and watch TV or stay home and read a book. Obviously TV. Gotta see what's on Netflix. It's not even a thing, I don't think, back then. Previously on Bon Appetit. Bon Appetit. Has anyone seen Henri? Yeah, he's in the kitchen. Unpacking the new tableware. Henri! <laughs> Did someone call me? Oh, Henri. <laughs> Ooh. 
Wednesday, September 3rd, morning. So that's actually where I'm going to end the video. I, I have no idea on what this is going to be lengthwise for this video, but I wanted to give like a little bit of a taste of what this game's like. If you want to check it out, go ahead and uh, log into Steam uh, and click the link down below. You can go ahead and check it out. I believe there's actually an open beta out right now, so you can play the beta if you want to just give it a shot. It's a really just relaxing game, pretty fun to play. Uh, if you want to see more of it on the channel, let me know in the comments. And uh, yeah, I think that's going to be it for this video, but uh, I will see you guys all in the next one.